Hello and welcome to this month's Department of Health and Social Care Board meeting. Yes, today we discuss A&E and progress we have made to privatise the NHS. Yeah. Yes. Privatise yes. Right, right, right. Yes. yes, I know this is a boring topic, but that Dr. Galloway... Galloway! Damn it. He's demanding we put our heads together and we need a plan. Over to you, Charles. Really give it to him, Charles, buddy. Really give it to him today, yes. Yes, yes. Wasn't the whole problem about those patients being seen in the corridors? Lovely clean corridors. Those doctors have no respect. Yes, yes, yes. I do remember, wasn't that Dr. Galloway? Galloway! Behind the media finding out. Yes, he was, unfortunately, because... People mm. did not like patients mm. being seen in corridors. Mm. But don't worry, me and some of my chums downstairs came up with an idea. Oh, oh, I'm so glad you asked. Mm. What we did <laughs> is we rebranded corridors as cohort areas. Well, what did it work? I'm so glad you asked. Let me show you my graph. Mm. <laughs> Yes, yes, yes. Since we rebranded, there have been no patients seen in corridors. A call for 100% reduction. Mm, no oh, corridors. Yes, 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 yes. I guess no corridors mean no patients. Well, obviously. Mm, yes, I'm so smart. <laughs> anyway, with results like this, we're going to roll this out nationwide. So what we're going to do is we're going to rebrand those waiting areas as an opportunity for mindfulness. <laughs> and that stress-related work breakdown as maternity leave. Uh, no, no, we got rid of maternity leave. Uh, well, that proved to be too damn difficult when the doctors started bringing their children to work. I mean, the noise was just bloody horrendous. Yes, yes, we had to make the junior doctors work for longer because they had to look after the consultants' kids. Oh. Make them work for like minimum wage. Yeah. 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 I just don't understand these people. Why can't they just go to nanny? I had a nanny and I was fine. <laughs> I love my nanny. <laughs> Why don't we rebrand it as, um, Reflections on Clinical Practice? Mm. Yes, Bob's great work. Hunt, you're really inspiring us to do great stuff. Yes. 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 I am the health secretary that this country deserves, not the one it needs. My work is never <laughs> over. So, Charles, will you please take us through the recent changes to help flow rate through AD? Mm. Mm. Really give it to him, Miss Charles. Come on, like when you whack that golf ball on the driving range. Ah, uh, yes, my old boy. <laughs> what we've decided to do is move the hospital further up the hill. <laughs> <laughs> So, the really unwell patients going up the hill will fall down. <laughs> Literally! Leave <laughs> them there to die, I said! <laughs> yes, yes. And due to the falling brickwork, patients were being sent back into a &E. As a result of this, we had to refurbish the entrance. But we got our money back. Because what we realised is, if we kept the doors closed, there were less patients entering the hospital. Yes, sir! Okay, so, Denise, where are we on the hospital side? Well, I've made a couple of prototypes. Mm. Can you see this one? Denise, I can't see the ratty thing, it's tiny. Hit the nail on the head. So I thought these tiny signs, if we place them here, here, here and here, mm. even though the beds are actually here, here and here, all the patients will be heading over here and they'll never find the beds, they'll never find their relatives, they'll be so confused that everyone will just leave. <laughs> <laughs> Confuse them to death! <laughs> Yes, it is a really big hole. 
Oh. <laughs> well, uh, so how is this helping reduce patient intake into the hospital? Well, currently at any one point, 50% of hospital staff are staring out of the window into the big hall. Understandable. Very understandable. This means that patients either get bored of waiting at A&E or they die. <laughs> I say kick the patients in the hall. <laughs> the other day. I did. I love looking at all those cranes and diggers. <laughs> <laughs> well done, Bob. Don't you Yes, well done. Well, we have made some great progress mm. here, I can see. I can see we can really go back to HQ and gain some traction. With all these great ideas, we can privatise before the plebs have a chance to vote us out. Privatise! Privatise! Privatise!